What's up guys, it's your boy Random Gaming Star back with another video of Car Parking Multiplayers 2. A guy was asking me to tune Jeep Grand Cherokee Trackhawk from so many days, as I promised to him. So here I'm with a 2200 plus HP Jeep Grand Cherokee Trackhawk tune. So without wasting any time, let's get into this video. Don't skip any part of the video, you might miss some settings. First of all, we will test this car at the dyno run to check how much HP we are getting right now. So let's go to Dino Run to test the HP. I can also show you guys all the controller settings to test the max HP. As you guys can see, we are currently getting around 1,950 horsepower at the Dino Run, which means we will get around 2,200 horsepower at the drag. Now let me show you guys the engine setup on this Jeep. I've installed a Mate 380-3799cc engine. You guys can change the engine from engine market. Now let's head towards the parts that are installed on the block of this engine. So these are the parts that are installed on the block. You guys can simply pause the video and copy all these settings one by one. These are the head parts of the engine. And now the rear system parts of the engine. Now the fuel system parts of the engine. Then the cooling parts of the engine. And at last turbocharger and ECU is stock. Now let's move forward to the gearbox setup of this car. I've installed ZFGS6 a TAWD gearbox. My gearbox configuration is default, so you can alter the gearbox configuration to achieve less seconds in drag and even 2300 horsepowers. Guys, I have to choose this gearbox because of weight of this Jeep. So I preferred a gearbox with 6 gears. Now let's move further to the suspension setup of this car. So these are the suspension settings that I've done on this car, which includes alignment and spacer settings. These are the anti-roll bars and spring settings. And at last, bump and rebound settings. Now let's go to maintenance, setup. In maintenance setup, make sure your tires and oil is in good condition. and I'm using E85 fuel. Now let's move to the visual tuning to adjust the size of the rims and tires. I can show you guys all the kits too that I've installed. You guys can copy my fitment or even make your own fitment. I'm using Touring Tires. And this is the rims and tires size that I'm using. Alright guys, that's all from settings. Now let's test this track, Hawk on Drag. So let's go to Drag Track. As you guys can see, we're getting around 2200 horsepower at drag. Let's test how much seconds we can achieve. So here we go. Two hundred plus in seconds. 
So we have cleared this track in 7.8 seconds with six gears. Gearbox. I will also try a gearbox with four gears later in this video, so don't close the video here. Now we will test its top speed at the highway. So let's go to highway. Alright guys, we're now at the highway. So here we go again. Can you guys guess what would be the top speed of this car? Let me know in the comments. So the top speed we got is around 405 kilometers or hour with this gearbox. Now it's time, try another gearbox to see if we can improve. So let's go back and find a new gearbox. Alright guys, we're back in our garage. Now it's time to find another gearbox. So let's do it. Here it is, let's buy and install it. All set, now it's time to test it. So let's go to Dino Run. Initial pick is a bit slow because the weight of this car. So this gearbox is giving us crazy 1,988 horsepowers at the dyno run. Let's check if it crosses 2,200 plus HP at the drag or not. So let's go to the drag track. As you guys can see, we're getting crazy. 2,200 plus HP at drag. Let's test how much seconds we can achieve. So here we go. Two hundred plus in seconds. So we have cleared this track in eight point three seconds. So we cleared this track in eight point three seconds, which is too slower than the previous gearbox. So I would recommend using the GS6A or TAWD gearbox. Now we will test the top speed of current gearbox at the highway. So let's go to highway. Alright guys, we're now at the highway. So here we go again. Can you guys guess what would be the top speed of this car? Let me know in the comments. So the top speed we got is 411 kilometers or hour on this gearbox, which is faster than the previous gearbox. Now, scores are level by one to one, so it's your choice to choose any of these gearboxes. So, alright guys, that's all I got for this video. If you found it helpful, make sure to leave a like and comment on this video. Also subscribe the channel for more upcoming content. And don't forget to press the bell icon, so you can instantly receive a notification whenever I post a new video. What should Boa next car to tune let me know in the comments. And one last request to must follow on Instagram, where I post about the upcoming tune, so must follow on Instagram. Link will be pinned in the comments. I really love you guys for your all the love support and kind comments. 
You guys definitely make my day better. Thank you so much for watching this video till the end. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye.